guys, thank you so much for joining. Let's go directly to the point. So, <laughs> positive reactors, hello, <laughs> hello. <laughs> can you hear me? Because uh, I can hear you loud and clear. So this is what has Marwa been left happening. The Let's and watch guys, when you come back. It's been there's a lot that has been happening behind the scenes, guys. There are people when you see. Let me tell you one thing. This is one I want to say. I want to say um, this without fear of favor. Not everyone is a good person. Uh, we uh, over the weekend we had a very bad experience with someone. Uh, all of us looked up to. Most of us looked up to. Very 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 bad experience. Very very bad experience. Is it over the weekend? Yeah, the past few days. I would say when we had a very 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 extremely bad experience. If I decided to talk about it right now, you guys would be shocked. Uh, <clears throat> You guys won't believe. I don't know most most of you will be like, no, no, mean how we. But I'm telling you, we had a very bad experience. Uh, I don't want to call names. I don't want to mention names, guys. But it was so bad, we could not believe it. We could not believe it. And uh, most of us know what is going on. Most I don't know if, like majority of us know what is going on. YouTubers, especially the positive YouTubers, will be like. Um, so, uh, like going on with positivity, 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 positivity. We had a very bad, bad, bad experience. One of us, if not two or three, yeah, were dragged into some drama that is was super unnecessary. <laughs> that was super, 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 super unnecessary, guys. And it really changed the, the, my image of a certain individual or certain individuals, guys. You know, uh, I don't, I don't know where people get the, uh, the, the, the. I don't know where people get the... Sometimes I wish I could speak freely, but because uh, of the respect I have for Nyabuhansi sometimes, that you don't have to say everything up here. And of course, it will put a lot of people on target. Uh, it will really, really divide people's opinion. A very, very controversial thing happened over, over a few days ago. And uh, and it, it has not been funny. Me, personally, I'm super, super disappointed. Because I know the moment the moment I open my mouth and say like this, it will be the beginning of fire in Nyabuhansi again, you know? To be the beginning of issues again so i'd rather just keep quiet maybe hopefully in future i hope we can address those things without really um without hurting anyone you know so yeah that is what has been happening if you don't see the entire footage of course i'll share but that is what has been happening and i'm like as expected guys you want to tell me you guys didn't expect that of course we've been talking about that always like almost every single day we talk about that we know the character of these individual we know the character of dimwango we know so for someone that was caught off guard i'm like do you even watch these people i'm like do you even watch these people because uh this person this person is just so notorious out here and we know <laughs> we know how she moves we could not believe it and uh most of us know what is going on most i don't know if like majority of us know what is going on youtubers especially the positive youtubers will be like um so, uh, like going on with positivity 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 we had a very bad 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 experience one of us if not two or three yeah were dragged into some drama that is was super unnecessary <laughs> that was super 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 unnecessary guys and it, it really changed the, the, my image of a certain individual or certain individuals guys you know uh i don't i don't know where people get the uh the, the the i don't know where people get the sometimes i wish i could speak freely but because uh, of the respect i have for nyabuhansi sometimes that you don't have to say everything up here and of course it will put a lot of people on target uh it will really really divide people's opinion a very very controversial thing happened over, over a few days ago and uh, and it, it has not been funny with me personally i'm super super disappointed because I know the moment the moment I open my mouth and say like this, it will be the beginning of fire in Yabuhansi again. You know, it will be the beginning of issues again. So I'd rather just keep quiet. Maybe hopefully in future, I hope we can address those things without really um, without hurting anyone. You know, because right now if I address it, or if we address it, there are people who are going to be hurt so badly. Trust me. I don't know even if I'm one of them. I'm not sure. But there are people who are really, really going to be hurt. And uh, I'm super, super disappointed, I swear to God. Super disappointed, guys. And it has made me even look at people in a very different way. Let me tell you one thing. 
don't ever ever in your life no matter how well off no matter how better you're doing look down upon anyone that you think will not be uh, is not your equal you know never do that i witnessed that and i saw harassment someone was harassed someone i know was seriously seriously harassed you know and uh, i don't know if this will be spoken by anyone of of the the, the 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 victims of that really happened there but someone who really who's really passionate about their work someone who is really um really does their who really minds their business someone who really really is not interested in in drama or issues was was underwent something very very bad guys someone you all know i'm not going to say names i've, I've never I've, I've not known to not i'm not the kind to hide the names but this time i'm just going to cover it up just for the sake of peace you know and uh and this person was harassed by also someone we all care about you know someone we are passionate about you know and it really gave a very um ugly picture of this other individual that we 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 we, 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 I don't know. It really gave a, it, it really gave a very bad impression about this person that we all, 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 uh, look up to, you know, it was not a good scene and we were very angry. We were very mad. We were very disappointed guys. But personally, I have a very different approach to this. My opinion, my reaction is so different from anyone else. I don't know. Just call me out in the comment section. If you think that, uh, am I reaching or uh, I'm just not on track, but I'm so different from anyone else. This is the reason, guys. I'm, I'm reacting. I'm giving my opinion on these shoes. And then I'll come on our own shoes. So this person, before I even go to that point, this person, this individual, of course, Nasto, who else are we talking about? So, Nasto is out here. Hmm? He was kicked out. Out. And uh, this, allegedly, because I don't know the entire story, but of course, having watched people with connections over there, you know, who can know the, the real thing, what is happening? This is what I have to say. From reliable sources, this is what I have to say. Um... This is what happened, not even what I have to say. This is what happened. Of course, the party was going on. And now, <laughs> the party was going on, but I guess Dimwango was at a distance. Like, okay, you came over. You came over. Okay, you came over, but you want to pretend like, okay, you've been all good all along. Because I don't buy this BS that people are like, oh, Dimwango wanted that. <laughs> Dimwango wanted a thing with this person and because it didn't go as planned she's out here being bitter come on, come on guys I don't believe that honestly let me know if you do but I don't buy that I don't, but of course don't come for me like oh what is happening are you being paid? no, no one is paying me, no one is paying me but this is what I just have to say, I don't believe that because I don't know if, if I love to go back to the receipts, but I've shared this number without times. Number without times, Lamborghini Mwango has come out here to tell us that some people, some people in the village were looking down upon them when they were growing up. But now after the tables have turned, these people want to come over and pretend huh? like uh, not, nothing happened, but something else that, uh, that makes me almost side with uh side with dimwango is that uh the reason why i stand with dimwango is that uh, she came out here and she shared the story that this person nasto would sometimes maybe dimwango was with someone else for example for example maybe she was seated somewhere with the chef matiko i'm using that example because they ca they come from the same village so for example they are sitting together Nasta would greet um, Chef Matiko, for example, and ignore Dimwango. So, guys, I know we are not supposed to be <laughs> eventful or uh, we are not supposed to revenge on the past. But tell me, tell me if that was right. Of course not. Tell me if you were in that situation. Let's just be very honest. If you were in that situation, would you, <laughs> would you have just let this person come over? Hmm? 
use you because of course that is using we just have to be honest we come out here we use their content they are out there using our names they are out there some of them are out there using uh saint so some are using lambo so it's a circle it's a circus so tell me if you were in a lambo's shoes would you have just let let this person would you have let nasto just come over and use you after after he treated you in that manner of course not so let's just uh, we just have to be honest on that side honestly <laughs> But of course I don't excuse what she did because this is what, what happened. Our girl stood up. Our girl stood up and uh, caused a sin. Caused a sin. <laughs> and of course people, the peacemakers, hmm? the, what do we call this guy who came to Kenya for peacekeeping missions? What do we call the Kofi Annan? <laughs> In Kenya if you want to refer to someone is the peacemaker you call that person Kofi Annan. Kofi Annan came over when uh, Kenya was uh, in these post-election violence. I don't know if that is allowed over here. The Kofi Annans stood up and uh, wanted to defend, not even wanted, they stood up. Of course you know what I mean by stood up. Yeah, they came through. They wanted to peace, <laughs> to maintain the peace, the peacemakers, the Kofi Annans of the of the villa they wanted uh what why am i using the term wanted no they stood up and uh, defended nasto like oh d don't do this no this person didn't intend to do this and that but now this is what i have to say uh, these people yeah i understand they didn't want a scene of course for peaceful using situation for peaceful for peace you know so that people can have their content and uh make their money and that is it or for for whatever reason that was <laughs> that was intended for whatever reason they were looking for peace you know they tried to maintain peace but who is lamborghini who is this girl she went off on everyone on that uh on that villa so that is what transpired but now my point is this <laughs> Minawe has always been this girl, you know, mentioning names, all this and that, but now <laughs> she knows who to mess with, you know. But I understand because uh, you come out here mentioning Di Mwango's name, mentioning Di Mwango's name, you'll be kicked out. Huh? <laughs> you'll be kicked out or uh, not even kicked out, but because of course she's not staying at the villa or some, something. No, this is what I mean. Uh, Senso's subscribers and these subscribers will come for her but of course you know she's she's talking her truth you know that is what she saw that is what she witnessed she's free to to express how she feels to say what she wants it's a free world but of course you know who we are talking about the fanatics they don't care you come for a person they they support yeah, they support, but uh, they support blindly. They'll come for you. So, I understand that. <laughs> if I was even a friend, I'd advise her. But because I'm over this side, of course, we want her to come out here. Mention the names, mention. But of course, I'd understand why she will not mention the name. Because, hey, don't mention. Or they'll come for you. Even if you're a positive reactor, they'll come. So guys, this is what I was saying. That is what transpired. You cannot come out in, um speak your truth <laughs> freely because you're not, deal you're not you're dealing with people who support people blindly. They don't criticize when necessary, where necessary. But of course, I'm not coming for the entire subscribers. No, I'm coming for a few. I'm not even coming. I'm just stating the facts. So... This is what I meant by I'm giving my own contrary opinion. I support Dimwango because if this person treated you that way, if this person treated you that way, can you imagine someone would come over, greet one person, hey, put yourself in that situation, come so allegedly, that is what Dimwango said. Nasto has not come out here to mention how, if all these allegations are true, no. No, and of course, she will, he will not because Nasto is a smooth operator. Yeah, of course this individual, Nasto, will not come out here and defend himself or uh, give his side of the story because he is a very new name that I just came came across on whose? I think Strongman's, Mrs. Strongman's channel, which I just love that name because uh, it suits him. <laughs> 
he is a smooth operator, you know. He will not mention anything because, of course, he's trying to, to defend himself, <laughs> be on the good side. Of course, he has to be on the good sides of, uh, of the records, of these and census records, because if he dares to go against these people, not even against, to give his own side of the story, <laughs> regardless, as long as it paints these two, hmm, the royal families, in a negative light, that will be it. Because as I told you, there are some fanatics out here that uh, will support people, will follow people blindly, huh? without caring, without know, without even caring to know the truth or uh, the situation. So, of course, you should understand that. But this is what I wanted to say. Oh my God, I just like <laughs> diverting, giving just sideshows. So, just pardon me for that. This is what I wanted to say. Can you imagine this person treated you that way? Hmm? When you were not doing so well, but now he, he comes over and pretends like nothing happened. Just guys, just be honest. <laughs> be honest, because I'm also trying to be honest, to be honest with my own opinion. Of course, I'll not let that slide, you know. This is what I think should have happened. Now that uh, Nasto knows that uh, Dimango is beefing because of that, I think he should have, he should have just come over. Not even come over. Maybe he should have contacted Lamborghini. <laughs> He should have contacted Tingo Lashes hmm? and make amends with her or something in one way or another because he talks with Senso, you know. If he cannot get in contact with, uh, with D, at least he should have talked with uh, Marwa because <laughs> some people are just like that. They like revenging, you know. You cannot do anything about that. If you cannot work with that person, that is it because, of course, uh, Nasto can come over. Nasto can come over and fool you, you and me. But of course, he's not fooling D because of course D knows the tingle. D knows. This is my opinion, guys. If you think I'm just doing too much, let me know in the comment section. But I just want you to be very honest, you know, because that is not a good thing. Can you imagine you are with someone and this person greets one person? I think I'll have to pull that receipt because. That is what she said. He would greet one person and leave the other, but he won't. But this person is coming over your home, or your brother's home, and pretending, or your brother's home and pretending like nothing happened. He should apologize honestly because he knows exactly why you f why you feel like that, you know. But let me know. Do you buy this idea that uh, because oh she wanted this with this person, it didn't go as planned. That is why she's bitter. I don't buy that because uh. That is a theory that a lot of people go by, you know, if <laughs> if a lady is beefing with a man, that is the assumption, which I don't like, honestly, that people bring out here. Of course, people are so free to give their own opinion. It doesn't mean that uh, I'm beefing with anyone else that has different side of this story, but that has come out here to give their, their opinion. No, I'm just giving my honest, my honest opinion of how I see this, of course. Of course, you would agree with me. That is, especially if you're, you're a Kenyan. I don't know if that is a common thing around the world. I don't know. Let me know how you feel. <laughs> what you think, wherever you're coming from. Let me know. I think that uh, that is a very common interpretation that people usually come out here. Of course, you would expect that uh, because I always come out here with that. I, I don't agree with that most of the times, but uh, this time, I think uh, if you're, you're giving your reactions, you just have to be very honest. And I'm just trying to be very honest. I think, of course, some people will come out here with that kind of uh, interpretation, just for fun, for entertainment. But I'm just trying to be honest, you know. I think that um, that is not the case. But of course, if you have the evidence, no. Of course, there is no evidence. Maybe you heard from someone, from someone, you know. You know what I mean. So... That is what I, that is what I think honestly. That is what I think. I think that is the reason because of course she came out here and mentioned that that is what has been happening. So, <laughs> and if you remember, that is the reason why she didn't come over for the party because hey, that person was treating you that way. Of course, I'm not coming out here to preach that uh, people should revenge on the past, but no, you treated me that way those days. Just come over, not even to come over. Why am I using that term? No, just express that uh, you're sorry if you are you know just apologize because of course you'll have to brush shoulders with someone who treated you some kind of way when you were not doing well 
<laughs> because I don't even have to repeat that. That is something that a lot of people have shared, that a lot of people have shared. One person was doing so well than the other person, which is life, you know. I know most of you will come for me like so. Huh, you're, you're that kind of a person, you like revenging. No, I'm just saying that uh, this is like that, you know, but you want to be in good terms with her. You want to be in good terms with her. Don't go around pretending like nothing happened and you clearly know why this person feels this way. Why this person feels this way. So just do the right thing and apologize. So I don't know how, but of course you understand what I'm trying to say. Hmm? <laughs> Fix the your issues, but don't assume that nothing is happening. Because I almost forgot because I want to close over. <laughs> I want to close it. I don't know if you're still seeing me. Are you seeing me? Am I visible? <laughs> Can you see me? Because uh, because uh, this smooth operator has decided that she, he will pretend like nothing is happening. <laughs> because he left this comment on a Prince Odinga's YouTube channel, I think so. So let me read it, but of course, I'll try and leave it somewhere here. So the comment read, uh, Big lies from the lazy gang. Big lies from the lazy gang. Watch our PGM domo. That means that I let them talk. So <laughs> this is a serious smooth operator. He knows that uh, there's something going on, but he'd rather come out here and pretend that nothing is uh, going on because at that point he's throwing Minhawi under the bus. Yeah, that is what is happening because she came out here and expressed what happened. You know, she didn't mention anyone's name, but it's so obvious. What it's so obvious. People know why <laughs> and who. Or what the story was. So, for the musica in, in Swahili, we say musica like the person in question to come out here and <laughs> and throw you under the bus. Like, like uh, those are just rumors. Nothing like that happened. Those are just people who want to talk. Let them talk, Mr. Smooth Operator. I don't. I think he's just an not an honest person, not sincere, and I understand. I understand why D feels this way. I stand with D this time around, but of course I don't stand with um, I don't uh, I don't stand with how she goes around, you know, <laughs> beefing with us, Nasto, you know how she reacts. How I can't even get that word. <laughs> I can't even get that word that I want to use in uh, expressing this. I don't like how she. How she, <laughs> I don't like how she goes a, around this thing, you know, because she's dragging everyone else. Because what was the point of kicking out people? What was the point of kicking out the likes of Minawi <laughs> or the, at the villa? What was the point, if not jealousy or if not just being an evil person? Because deal with the person you're dealing with. Don't come for everyone else. Who? Who has nothing to do with anything? So, guys. I'm so sure you cannot even see me. You're like, what is wrong with this one? Talking and you cannot even see her because it's already dark. So, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for joining. My people, I see you. I see you. Thank you so much for always coming back. For always coming back. <laughs> you guys can just make... Thank you so much for coming back. For my moderators, thank you so much for always coming to support your girl. I really appreciate you like so, so much, so much. So that was it for now. Until the next one, peace. Bye.